In this video, we're gonna create an alignment from a pipe network. But before we can do that, we actually have to have a pipe network. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a quick creation method with the pipe network so that we can create an alignment based off of it. So we're gonna drop down pipe network, we're gonna select create pipe network from object, and we're gonna zoom into the center line of our road that runs along the north side of all of our properties. I'm gonna select the center line polyline that was brought in by turning on the C road center line layer. I'm gonna select it, I'm gonna accept the direction that it's running in, and the only changes I'm gonna to make to this window is I'm gonna choose a 24 inch concrete pipe, and I'm gonna change the structure to a null structure. And then I'm gonna select okay. So now that we have a pipe network, we can create an alignment from it. When we create an alignment from a pipe network, what you do is you drop down the alignment dropdown, you select create alignment from network parts. Civil 3D asks you to select the first connected network part. So we're gonna go ahead and select this first null structure. Then Civil 3D asks us to select the next network part. So you could go and select this pipe and then move on to this structure and then move on to that pipe and then move on to this structure. But inside Civil 3D, if you select this last structure here, it knows that this last structure is connected to that first structure by these three entities here, this pipe, that structure, and that pipe. So I can select the first structure and select the last structure, and it selects all the structures in between. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do then is now that I've selected all my structures, I'm gonna hit enter, and a creation window for an alignment pops up. I can choose what side I wanna put it on, what name I wanna give it, what style I wanna have, and what labels I wanna place. What you'll notice that we don't have available to us are the design criteria because this alignment is associated to this pipe network. We know it's not gonna be used for a creation method to create a road. It's meant for displaying this pipe network in certain ways inside of Civil 3D. Most often you're gonna be using it to then create a profile view. So we're gonna go ahead and work through these options. What you do have an option for is create profile and profile view when you create this alignment, because generally what you're gonna be doing when you create an alignment from a pipe network is you're gonna be creating a profile and then placing that pipe network inside that profile view. So we're gonna go ahead and click okay, and we get a create profile from surface window, and we can run through this. We're gonna go in this in more detail in another video, but just know that you would select a surface that you wanna have your surface profile cut from, and you're gonna click add, and then you're gonna click okay. And so then we get a warning that says the profile has been created, but it hasn't been, a window hasn't been created or a profile view window has not been created to display it inside of, and that's okay. But what we do now have is we have an alignment that's associated and it goes along the center line of this pipe, this pipe network. So what you can do now is you can select that alignment and what you'll see is you have the grip edits. It's very similar to when we created our alignment from objects. You'll see it's all the circular grip edits. We have circular grip edits again. There's no tangency to be maintained. And actually what you can see here is there's a warning here that says tangency violated. The alignment that was created for this, there isn't, the tangency isn't correct between this line and that arc. And so it's warning us, hey, there's not actually tangency happening right here. So what we know is we don't wanna go ahead and use this later for some form of uh, roadway creation because we don't have tangency. But we do now have an alignment that we can use to create a profile and profile view window for our pipe network.